I guess the way I would describe my childhood, I'd say it, it was an adventure. My mom worked minimum wage, you know, try hauling seven kids working minimum wage. I remember we'd get food stamps, and within the first week, the food was gone. It's like we just raided, like, <laughs> it was survival of the fittest. I was pretty much bullied by all my brothers and sisters. I was the youngest, I was a guinea pig. I had a lot of frustration because I couldn't beat them. They were too big. So I think as a little kid, it's always been engraved in me. I love to compete. I don't even consider myself a fighter. I'm a competitor. Oh, que tienes todo. Something, something about me, I love singing, man. Even if I can't sing, I'm kind of like, I guess the fighter that I can resemble a lot the most is Manny Pacquiao. I wonder how Kim Kardashian does it. With all these cameras, every day, she's like. <laughs> I remember the first time I had my dream of becoming an Olympic champion. I was watching the 1996 Olympics, and I saw this African-American man by the name of Michael Johnson. And you know, we lived in a trailer at that time. And, you know, black and white TV, with wooden panels on the side. And the only way to change the channel was with the pliers, and the only way to get reception was making sure that it was, was pointing at the right axis. And I saw Michael Johnson shatter the world record with his infamous gold shoes. and. That, that changed my life forever. The first time I saw wrestling was at a, at a dole match. It was in junior high. And when I saw that, I was just like, whoa. I saw these two kids go at it, and then the principal would come up to them and shake their hand. I was just like, man, I'm so used to fighting and then getting in trouble, getting pulled by the principal. <laughs> Started wrestling, love at first sight, and then from there, things just kicked off. I, I won every peewee tournament, every high school tournament in the country. And then I finally made my first world team represent the United States. To me, I think my greatest asset is my mind, is my belief, is my trust. That I, if I can do what my mom did, what, what a lot of these immigrants do for their family, if I can do it in wrestling, then I can become the best in the world. To get a ticket to the Olympics was, was a dream of a lifetime. I was the least likely to succeed and win the Olympics. And uh, I went in there and pretty much shocked the world. In wrestling, I became the youngest in history to ever win a gold medal. Till this day, it's still kind of mind boggling. Everything that I've worked for finally came true. It's que es mucho trabajo ahí, mijo. ¿Sí me entiende? Mucho. Es necesario. Es necesario. Sí, es necesario. I was too young to retire from athletics. And uh, I knew MMA was the next step. So now I'm chasing that belt. <laughs> so it's cuatro. I've boxed for five years now. Uh, I've won the copper gloves here in Arizona. I've won really tough tournaments out here in, uh, in Arizona and boxing, the sport of boxing. So they're in for a rude awakening, whoever believes that I'm just a wrestler. Very, very light sparring, very light, okay? At this point, he's not just a wrestler, he's a mixed martial arts guy. He has a striking, he has a submission. Good. The world is going to realize that Henry is a, is a threat to everybody. He's, he's after that belt. I mean, you saw it in his first fight in the UFC. He didn't even take the guy down, and he, he stood on his feet. He outstruck a striker, a guy that was bigger than him, a guy that had more experience than him. So I'd say that his striking is high level. If I can keep it on my feet, if I can stand with somebody, then I will display an art of punches, kicks, and elbows. I feel like I'm the new sheriff in town. I'm not scared. I'll fight anybody. Like I said, I'll fight Conor McGregor. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He's going to come after me. <laughs> You're not going to embarrass me in front of my family. You're not going to embarrass me in front of my girlfriend. I'm going to prevent that. Let it go. Good, angle, good. It's gonna get vicious. 
At 125 pounds, I know I'm the best in the world. I just gotta prove it. Just give me the shot.